I'm Basil, I manage the nursery for Rainforest Rescue and I want to bring you a fast fact about the bleeding heart tree, also known as Homolanthus novo guineensis. The bleeding heart occurs in Northern Queensland, it also occurs through Northern Territory, Western Australia, up into Papua New Guinea, hence novo guineensis, and Solomon Islands as well as a few other places. It's a fantastic tree to use in reforestation because it naturally loves disturbed sites. It grows up relatively quickly. It has, as you can see, dense amounts of leaves, which turn this beautiful red as they're um, beginning to senesce or die, fall from the tree, hence the bleeding heart. Once these leaves fall, it, it helps create uh, mulch and leaf litter on the ground, which goes to helping soil condition, protecting microbes um, within the soils, and, and really kicks off that rehabilitation process of, of restoring soils and health to the environment. One of the reasons I love putting this plant in is because it's a favoured feed tree for the Hercules moth, which is this amazing moth we have up north here that, that grows to about this size. It's the largest moth in Australia, and it's definitely one of the world's largest moths. I hope you've enjoyed these fast facts and I'll catch you next time.